the bushes actually boarded the train in Navasota and took it up here to College Station. And this is the perfect place for College Station. Why? Well, because the train is parked near a water tank. Okay, so look at this hose that's trailing over there to the locomotive. That hose is connected right to the train. Well, it'll be there for a few hours because the locomotive holds, get this, 25,000 gallons of water and it needs to be refilled. The massive Union Pacific train departed Houston this morning and made a stop in spring in Navasota and transported President H.W. Bush's 4141 locomotive, which looks tiny in comparison to the big boy. This thing hasn't run on Texas tracks in about 60 years. It was built in 1941, but retired 20 years later. It weighs more than a million pounds and originally ran on 56,000 pounds of coal. Woo! Right now, the train is touring Texas, but if you miss it, don't worry. Union Pacific is looking at new ideas. The big boy uh, is uh, will finish off its uh, tour. It's on about a 110-day tour altogether this year. It'll finish up in Cheyenne, Wyoming about Thanksgiving. Uh, and then uh, next year we'll take her out again for a little trip. The big boy will be parked in College Station until tomorrow morning at 8. We have the schedule on our website. Just head over to abc13.com. Now, it's dry now, but it was cold and wet earlier today. Still, coming up on Eyewitness News at 6, we're going to tell you why that didn't stop the magical moment and thousands of coming out and seeing this train come up here to College Station. We're live in College Station. Nick Notario, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.